The singing lion. This is a little lion. He loves singing, but he can't sing in tune. Let's sing, mom, says little lion. But his mom is busy and has no time to sing with him. Not now, dear, I'm cooking dinner. The little lion is walking around, singing quietly. He comes to a giraffe. Let's sing, giraffe, says little lion. The giraffe binds her long neck to listen. But she soon shone back up again. Not now, thank you, she whispers. I'm getting a sore throat. Oh, poor giraffe, thinks little lion. I hope I don't lose my voice. The little lion is walking around, singing quietly. He comes to zebra. Let's sing, zebra, says little lion. It goes like this. But Zebra is going to visit her uncle. She is very busy. Not now, she says. I must visit my uncle. All the other animals suddenly disappear too. The little lion can't understand it. Suddenly, he sees a film crew. Let's sing. I know a very nice song, roars the little lion. But the explorer and his film crew panic. They drop their megaphones and run away. Little Lion finds a megaphone. There is no silence in the jungles. Let's sing a song, shouts Little Lion. It is funny for him to sing through the megaphone. Animals don't know what to do. At last an old snake comes to him and shows him a nice lonely cave. Go inside the cave, she says. Someone inside wants to sing with you. The little lion goes into the cave. He is a bit afraid. It is very dark here, says little lion. I know, says an old snake. It is because my friend is very shy. But he likes your songs. Little lion runs into the cave and sings at the top of his voice. And he listens to another voice singing his song. Little lion spends much time singing with his new friend in the cave. And all the animals are happy because of silence.